Ho ho ho, Merry Christmas! Time to open some unstable. Box number two for Christmas. Alright, here we go. Boom. So, let's get this done. Boom, so far. Sorry, it's kind of zoomed in. I had that problem yesterday. Now I know how to open the boxes. Unbox number two. Get that out of here. Bum, bum, bum. Got me a holiday beverage here. That is a uh, Makers and Coke. So, for all you underage, drink responsibly. Oh, wait, for all you any age, drink responsibly. You can tell I've had a few drinks, right? Alright. So here it goes. Put that there. Let me, let me, uh, let me, uh, let me tilt this a little bit. Ho, 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 Merry Christmas. Here we go. I started making a video and then I hit a button on my, uh, my phone. And I'm like, uh, crap. So, I already opened it up. I opened it up at that part. <laughs> Obviously, I lost. Maybe I'll edit it back in. But, um, Merry Christmas. Yes, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Alright, here we go. We're gonna just bust this up. I got me a holiday beverage here. Got me a Makers and Coke. Cheers to MTG community. Got my Dolphins glass. These are like 20 years old. My 20 year old dolphin glasses. I had a set of four and I'm down to two. <laughs> one of my kids broke one by accident, and one of my party goers at a, at a party broke one. So I'm down to two. So, um, although I am actually technically uh, boycotting football this year, let me move my cup over here. I'm protesting the protesters this year, so you're, that's fine. I 100% agree with your right to uh, protest the national anthem if you want to, but um, I have my right to protest you, so I'm not watching any NFL football. My favorite, well, my second favorite sport. Maybe it's my third favorite sport. Baseball and then running would be first and second. Alright, so let's get going. We're going to bust this out. We're going to do this faster than we did last time. You can hear my squeaky chair in the background. Alright, let's just boom, 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 boom. That's uncommon. Wow, this is one of those big packs. We're going to put the commons way over here outside of the camera. And boom, boom, boom. Uncommons right there. Who got me a foil? First pack. And a rare. And land. Something's a little different this time. And I'm going to keep my contraptions over here. We are like really out of focus. There we go. Let's do that. Let's do that. And then a clue token. Alright. So bam, bam, bam. Right here is my foils, my contraptions, my uncommons, and my rares. Actually, let's put contraptions over here. Where is the mythic school here? Land. Tokens. And foils. Okay. So let's get going. Here we go. Where did my other full pack go? I don't know. Um, commons. Uncommon, uncommon, uncommon. Rare. Land, contraption, contraption, token. All right, next. Next. There it goes. Bam, bam, bam. Um, uncommon, uncommon. I mean, uh, common, common, common. Stack. Uncommon, uncommon, uncommon. Um, ooh, mythic. Nice. Land. Ooh, we got a foil. It's a full contraption. Let's open that separate. 
Between contraction, contraction, and a beast token, yes. I need some beast tokens. Alright. I know in the first video I was noobing out on opening the packs. I've got back in the hang of it, so. Sorry. Alright, here we go. Planes. A rare contraption. Uncommon contraption and a full elemental token. Nice for my young um, young pyromancers there. Okay. There's my commas. I'm trying to get that in focus. Uncommon, uncommon, uncommon. Rare. Is it just my imagination or is it actually fuzzy? Mountain. Contraption, contraption, the zombie. Nice. Nice zombies. <laughs> Look at that zombie. That's a nice zombie. He looks like he's. I don't know, I guess is that an Innistrad zombie? He looks very Innistrad y. That or he might be going to a uh, Rolling Stones concert. Alright, common, uncommon. Uncommon, uncommon, and X. Got another X. Swamp. That might be the best one. Really might. I mean, seriously? Okay, let's look at these. Just real fast. Mountain, eh, not so great. Plains. That's a nice picture, no doubt. Nice picture. There's some good planes out there. Forest. That's that's really, really nice. Really nice. Island. It's good, but like, seriously, I think, like, it really comes down to these two. And you know what? I'm going to have to go with Swamp. Really going to have to go with Swamp. Swamp is the best land from Unstable. Forest is second. I'm gonna say, let's see, islands and plains. I'm not sure if I like the islands or plains more. Maybe the island. You know, for a long time, I denied my love for islands. And then I realized, you know what? Not so bad. Blue is not so bad. I hated blue in the early days of magic. Uh, those of you that have watched my videos, you probably know. Like I started playing in Fallen Empires, <laughs> the worst set ever. So I didn't, I didn't know how bad it was. So, but I, but I did know this right from the beginning. Blue was the most powerful color. So foil, and um, I hated blue. And now, not so much. Do, do, do. Commons. Half a work. Steam powered. Hammer jammer. As luck would have it. Planes. Alright, I need me a. Man. There's a, we got, we've got a lot of rare and, and one mythic and like three rare contraptions already. That's pretty nice. Ordinary pony. Ordinary pony. When this creature is about, you may exile a target non-horse creature you control, then return to the battlefield under its under's control. Hmm. I have yet to play with this. I told my friends I want to draft it with them. But, you know, when you have, like, friends that are busy and professional careers, it's hard to find time. So, I haven't got a chance to do it yet. Calling you out, Rich. Calling you out. My friend Ryan will he'll be there pretty much any time I need him. Those of you in the 
southwest area in Texas probably no Ryan okay so that's a rare wait I got I got two rares in this pack right this rare and neither one are foils or is this my imagination rare and rare you know I still have a stack of these I opened like I don't know tons of future sight like Case after case after case after case. Probably, I think I opened, I don't know, at least minimum of five cases of Future Sight. So what is that, 30 boxes? I have stacks of Steam Flogger, Steam, Steam Flogger bosses. I'm still sitting because I didn't sell any, basically, right out of the uh, gate. I just, uh, hey, wait a minute, that's got like a, a dark border to it. All these other rares have a have like a silver border. I guess that's because this is actually playable in modern Legacy and Vintage. So they actually inserted that, I guess, into... That's interesting. I didn't even know that. See, I really haven't done my homework on this set. As you can tell, <laughs> I'm not here to educate you on it. I'm just a passive... Passive connoisseur. Passive materialist I guess in this manner All right now the kitchen sink hammer jammer and Grusilda monster masher planes mythic another mythic contraption wow that's two mythic contraptions and like two rare contraptions I think but I'm not certain. I've had a few drinks, so not entirely sure. Steam Flogger Service Rep. Kindly Cognition. Animate Library. I do want a foil land. That's really all I'm hoping to get out of this box is a foil land. <laughs> so that I can sell sell it and pay for the box. I mean I got these at good price, so I'm not really worried. I just want to get them sold before the reprint goes through. Because when the reprint goes through, there's a full. When the reprint, there's an. Wait, I put those uncommons over there in the in the rear. When the reprints go through, there's going to be a flood of this crap in the market. Another rare contraption. So. I want to get my uh, full land sold before. Before, before the market's flooded with these after Christmas. Mythic. Okay, Stormcrow. Commons. Water market, forest, and common common. Uh, dun dun dun. The countdown is at one. Another rare. Boy, we're just getting tons of rares and mythic contraptions in this in this box. We're mowing through this a lot faster than I did in the last time, I hope. <laughs> Alright, I'm coming. Still holding out hope for my... my. Uh, okay, this is a halfway point, because I already opened one from this side, so this is the last one from this side. So we've actually opened half the box. Um, maybe, just maybe. I got, um, today, hold on one second, I also got these in today, uh, Iconic Masters, I got these like dirt cheap, like on blowout clearance, so 
might have those to open too. I might open some of those. I'm sitting on quite a bit of those uh, cases. Well, I say case. Case is only two in this case, but um, you know, who knows? Oh, rare foil. Nice. Another rare contraption. So I might I might open some iconics. I'm just kind of sitting on them. I figure like for the price I got them for, you know, surely I can double those up in the next year. I mean, if you told me I can take hundred dollars and turn it to two hundred dollars in twelve to eighteen months, I'd be like, okay, sign me up. Where do I where do I do this? So. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Dun dun dun. One, two, three. And Earl of Squirrel. Nice. Squirrel link damage dealt by this creature also causes you to create that mini 1 1 green squirrel creature tokens. Damage, not not damage to an opponent. Creature tokens you control are squirrels and different other squirrel types. Other squirrels get plus one plus one. That's a pretty damn good card. I mean, I know it's like unstable, unglued, unhinged, all that crap, but still, pretty nice. Secret base. Add one mana of any color to your mana pool. Spin this mana only to cast a spell that shows a watermark with secret base. Interesting. Okay, uncommon. Everything in the Jake Forest. Alright, still waiting on my full land. I wonder what the distribution of full lands is. I have to look that up. I haven't opened tons of this. I don't even know if the set sells or uncommon sell or. I think I do know. I've seen a few cards. There's another rare contraption. They're pretty generous with the rares on the contraptions. Shouldn't be any problem getting a set of those. With that many rares, there's probably not a lot of uncommons and commons, I guess. One, two, three. Steam Flagger of the Month. Mountain. Common, common. A zombie. A zombie. I've been trying to get into EDH lately. I know if you watch my older videos, you know that like EDH is something I was a pretty noobish on. But as I just become more of a kitchen table magic player, I'm actually more interested in um, EDH now. And hear my squeaky chair moving around. I actually bought the. Um, the cat and the wizard um, EDH decks and I you know I've made my own changes to, to the wizard one anyway not really the, the cat one um, I bought a few cat things to, to add to it but they haven't come in yet because of Christmas slowing everything down but If there's any good places in the Dallas Fort Worth area that you know about to play some EDH, shoot me a uh, message or post it on this video. Because I wouldn't mind playing. I'm going to play casual magic. I'm not looking for like super competitive EDH, like blowhards. Oh, there we go. Oops that in the wrong thing. All right, rare hot fix. Forest, common, common, spirit token. I'm already here. Night of the widget. I actually like that artwork. It's pretty cool. Now the widget's power and toughness are equal to the number of order of widget watermarks among permanents. 
so kind of cool. Swamp. Another rare. A lot of rares, man. A lot of rare contraptions. If my video is uh, out of focus, let me know because right now I have my glasses off. Oh, nice. Urza. Is that my first Urza? It might be my first Urza. Maybe I got one on the other box. I can't remember. Anyway, if the focus is off, let me know. <laughs> I'm just, uh, I'm just moving this up a little bit. Some of these cards are very playable if they were, um, in standard. Or not, not playable by the sense that they're good, but like, they're reasonable for standard, for draft decks. Alright, let me move that back a little bit. Okay, commons. Uncommons. Better than one. Two-headed chicken turtle. Interesting. A person outside the game becomes your teammate. Choose any number of cards in your hand on top of your library or in the battlefield under your control. Those cards become your teammate's hand library. <laughs> Permanence, respectively. That's funny. Okay. Another rare contraption. That's cray cray. Alright, we're down to like the last five or six packs. So. Here we go. We're down to the last. One, two, three. Rare. Where's my full land? I want a full land, yo. I want a full land. Mmm. One, two, three, in commons, finds the rare swamp. Another rare contraption, rogue, with menace. You know, I was super excited about Almond Cat because I am, uh, one of my pastimes, one of my hobbies actually, I always say it's a hobby of mine, is ancient Egypt, like real ancient Egypt prehistoric and or what a lot of people would consider prehistoric but anyway I'm gonna get disappointed me quite a bit thought it'd be a little cooler it's disappointed still like it I still like the flavor but do it yourself serif forest Bam, bam, bam. Alright, last pack. No four lands so far. Last one, let's see the last one. You can do it. Come on, come on, come on. You can do it. Give it to me. Give it to me now. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Rolls Lawyer. No four land there. Mythic contraption. Oh well. Dun dun dun. I am Rob from MTG Investor, and I wish you a Merry Christmas. I don't care what your religion is. Merry effing Christmas, dude. <laughs>